Hey guys, welcome to my newest video. Thank you for clicking on it. What is going on? I hope everyone's having a fantastic day. Welcome to my newest video. I'm trying to figure out how to put this in the words, what I'm doing. Basically, what I'm doing today is I'm doing a DIY gummy soda bottle. All you need to do this is you need soda, because we are using the actual soda. So it's going to be whatever flavor soda you choose will be the flavor of what your jello is going to be. Just make sure you actually like the flavor. So the soda that I've chosen is Pepsi, but what else you need is you need original gelatin unflavored. You need a funnel. You need about, it's like 100 milliliters of water, but it's like a little under one cup, a little over one third. A bowl, fork. Oh, and I got this thing today. I actually don't know if I'm going to like it or not. Exacto knife. It's supposed to be like for pre like really precise cutting, and it's supposed to be like really good for like craft type stuff. So I'm gonna try this out today. I'll let you guys know if it works. But let's go ahead and get started with this video. It should be interesting. Let's hope I do it right. So what we're gonna do first is we are going to very very carefully take off the what is this? The covering of the Pepsi bottle. We're gonna use it later. I promise. The camera died. Okay. This is what I was saying was uh, I saw someone very carefully use the Exacto knife and try to get right under it without like ruining it. We don't want it to get ruined. And I ruined it. Just kidding. It's fine. Um. Oh, that was way easier. I'm gonna very carefully take the rest of it off. Okay. I didn't take it off the perfect way. So make sure you save this. We're gonna put this over here. And we're gonna go ahead and make our gelatin mixture. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get your water that we put aside. We're gonna get three of these packets and we're gonna mix it together. Hope it works, right guys? All right, we got our three packets in. You're gonna go ahead and mix that together as well as you can. It looks really gross, kind of like applesauce. Yeah, that seems good. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and move on. Put the Pepsi bottle liquid in here my first time doing this. I really don't even know if I'm doing it right, guys. So, like, fingers crossed this works out. We can put this bottle aside. We'll be back to that in a second. Basically, what we're going to do is we're going to put this mixture that we just made, which is kind of hard. Like, it's kind of... We're going to put it in here. I know what I did wrong. We're actually supposed to do eight packets. That was my fault. Luckily, I actually have enough to do that. So, let's go ahead and put our other packets in here. I'm going to hope that it still works by doing it this way and not the exact way that everyone else is doing it. That was my bad for not paying attention to the directions. Okay, so what I ended up doing was I ended up getting those packets and I scooped it out of here because it wasn't dissolving and I put it in the microwave for about 45 seconds and I let it melt and then I poured it in here and that seems to have worked. Now that we have our mixture, we have our lovely Pepsi mixture. We're going to open up the Pepsi bottle. We're gonna get our funnel ready and we're going to pour this mixture into the bottle without messing up. I'm gonna fill it to the very top so it actually overflowed. That's fine. Now that we have finished this, we're gonna put the top on and we're gonna put it in the refrigerator for a couple hours. I'm not 100% how long. I heard an hour, but I'm gonna probably give it about two or three hours and we'll go from there. All right, we'll put this in the fridge. It has been literally, let's see, when did I film? I filmed around three, it's 10. It's been about seven, almost seven hours. I look horrendous but i still want to f finish this with you guys so this is it it is i can tell it's definitely jello in there and i'm hoping that when i cut it open very carefully with my exacto knife exacto exacto knife to not ruin it fingers crossed let's try to do this guys okay i'm a little nervous i don't want to ruin it i'll be very upset if i ruin it <gasps> i cut into it maybe i can you know, now you use that to my advantage though. It looks so cool, guys. I'm just am really afraid of ruining it. Okay, got it. Okay. Very carefully, we're gonna peel it off. <laughs> I got a piece off. I'm gonna get scissors. How do you do this carefully? I swear, I have no idea what I'm doing. This is so hard. I'm so close to breaking it. <sighs> oh my God, I did it. All right, um, no, look, we're gonna put the cap on. <laughs> wait, wait, okay. Nobody laugh yet. <laughs> look at it. All right, you know what? I don't care what any of y'all haters say. I did it. Let's get a closer look at it, shall we? All right, so here's what we got. Nice Pepsi bottle. So it kind of got beat up on the way through because I'm not the most gentle person when it comes to like doing this stuff. So if we take a quicker look here, we got my Pepsi bottle, which actually I think came out really nice. I kind of want to cut it open, don't you? I'm gonna get my X-Acto knife just cause I want to feel like it's still useful. And we're going to go like this, ready? Look 
Look at that perfect little bottom. Tastes like Pepsi Jello. Mmm. If you like Pepsi, you would like it, okay? If you like soda, you would like it. I don't like soda. But all right, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video like I demolished it. I suck. I already demolished it. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a big old jelly thumbs up. Makes no sense, but do it anyways. Leave a comment down below about what other videos you want to see me do. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel more videos. I post videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. I'll see you guys later. Ow. I'll see you guys later. Hello. I love you.